today I'm gonna be restarting Ronaldo's career, but everyone else is in their prime. Oh no, Prime Messi's in. Oh my days, Messi, please, 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 Messi. Though this is the highest level of skill that world football has ever seen, Ronaldo would have a decent start to his first ever Premier League season. There it is, let's go. His good form would continue as he kept on scoring goals for Manchester United. Oh, no, he's, he's okay, man, he's not that bad. His first season would result in him scoring eight goals and getting eight assists, including a hat-trick away from home at Everton, which was enough for Ronaldo to win the PFA Young Player of the Year award. <laughs> Bro, he's on fire! Winning Young Player of the Year is a pretty big deal, but Ronaldo has way bigger plans for his future. I don't care about the awards. My dream is to win the World Cup for Portugal. The World Cup starts in just four seasons, and if Ronaldo wants to win, he's going to have to get much better. As the first season comes to an end, Man United didn't come close to winning the Premier League by finishing only fourth, but they still have a shot at winning the Champions League as they're in the round of 16 against Juventus. But it wasn't going to be an easy match because Juventus have Prime Di Maria, Paul Pogba, Alexandro, and Benucci. And Pogba didn't hold anything back against his old club. Oh my god! Days. How are you even supposed to defend against that? And it doesn't stop there because Di Maria also had something to say against Manchester United. That was so filthy! And with Ronaldo being unable to score his chances, we would see Man United get eliminated from the Champions League. Back to the lobby. Heading into Season 2, Ronaldo has really improved and now he's an 81 overall. He's actually usable now, okay. And his hard work seems to be paying off because compared to last year, Ronaldo's way faster and stronger and it's resulting in him scoring way more goals and getting much more assists as well. Ronaldo would more than double his goal scoring record this year, scoring 20 goals and getting 10 assists, but this is all against smaller clubs like Wolves, Brighton and Southampton. Oh my days, oh my days, what an assist! But his first real test of this season would come playing against Tottenham at home. And with an attack consisting of Prime Heung-Min's son, Prime Christian Eriksen, Prime Gareth Bale, and of course Prime Harry Kane, it was gonna be a long day. No! Harry Kane! No! Please! Please! Oh my days, what are you supposed to do against that? Use those young legs! Come on Ronaldo! Oh my days! No! Bill! Someone stop Bill! Stop him! Stop him! Oh, Harry Kane strikes again. No, 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 no. After that embarrassing loss to Tottenham, Ronaldo needed a big game against Chelsea to prove his haters wrong, and that's exactly what he did. Ronaldo, finish! Yes! There it is! Take that, Todd Bowley. And with that win over Chelsea, Manchester United would finish second in the Premier League. However, if Ronaldo wants to get good enough to win the World Cup, he'll have to do better than second place. The Premier League might be over, but next, United play Dortmund in the Champions League. Oh my days, prime Marco Royce. This is gonna be a hard one. It's just not Marco Royce, though, because they also have Jaden Sancho, Aubameyang, and Mario Götze all in their prime. But there is no way that Ronaldo's gonna let that stop him. Finish that, Ronaldo! Come on, yes! Back into Ronaldo. Oh, what a turn! Finish! Oh my days, Ronaldo's on fire! With that goal, United secured the win against Dortmund, but the real test is gonna come up against Atletico Madrid, who they're facing next in the quarterfinals. And with an attack consisting of prime Luis Suarez, Antoine Griezmann, and Memphis Depay, the cards were stacked against Ronaldo. Prime Suarez is actually pretty fast. I think I can catch him. I think I can catch him. Oh, no, I can't. I can't. I can't. Unfortunately, things only got worse. No, oh my days, what was that passing? Holy crap, did you see that passing? Get back here, Depay. No, that was so cheeky. Suarez hat trick. Oh my goodness. And just like that, Luis Suarez ended Ronaldo's second season with another fail. Man, prime Luis Suarez, he just couldn't compete, bro. Getting humiliated like that in the Champions League only motivated Ronaldo to come back stronger next season. Oh my days. Okay, he's ready, bro. He's ready now. And this season is going to be Ronaldo's last chance to win the Premier League and the Champions League because next year is the World Cup. And all the work Ronaldo did in the offseason really showed because this year he broke the Premier League goal scoring record, scoring 40 goals and getting 16 assists. Ronnie, Ronnie, Ronnie! 
that's his second the Tottenham can't handle him, man. Let's go. This amazing record helped Ronaldo win the PFA Player of the Year award, cementing his name in the history book. But the season's not over yet. There's still one more game left to be played, and if Man United can beat Man City, Ronaldo will win his first ever Premier League title. However, beating prime Manchester City is not gonna be easy. No, 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 no. Holland, yo, this City team's crazy, man. Even though City took the early lead, Ronaldo was not giving up. Come on, Ronnie. Finish that. Yes, there we go. Okay, we're winning this title, man. We're taking this title home. But then out of nowhere, Laporte scored the luckiest goal of all time. You're kidding. And then in the 87th minute when United needed a hero, Marcus Rashford would step up. Oh my days, Marcus Rashford. And the rest is history. Ronaldo! There it is! That's the win! We've won the Premier League! Oh my days, I can't believe it! And just like that, we've won the Premier League with Manchester United, but the season's not over yet, and we still have to play the Champions League. First up would be AC Milan and Prime Ibrahimovic, but Ronaldo would end this game and send the Italians packing by scoring two goals. Easy, man, easy. With AC Milan out of the way, it was now time to fly to Germany to play FC Bayern in the quarterfinals. And this is gonna be the toughest game yet as Ronaldo's gonna be facing prime Manuel Neuer, prime Sadio Mane, and prime Thomas Muller. Even though Neuer's 96 overall, Ronaldo made it look easy and he scored two goals to send Bayern packing. You see how high he jumped? Ronaldo knocks off Bayern and we're headed to the semifinals. But in the semifinals, Ronaldo would have to play his ex club Real Madrid, who now have prime Luka Modric. Prime Tony Cruz, Prime Benzema, and Prime Vinicius Jr. Ronaldo didn't let this stop him though because within 25 minutes he'd already scored two goals and taken the lead against Real Madrid. Yes, that's two. It's over for Real Madrid, bro. It's over for Real Madrid. He already had two goals, but he wanted more, so he would later finish his hat trick and send Manchester United to the Champions League final. Finish him off. Oh my days. With that huge win, United will now travel to Paris to play PSG in the Champions League final. But this would be Ronaldo's hardest game yet because he's going to be facing off against Prime Messi, Neymar, Mbappe, and Sergio Ramos. Don't ask me how, but Ronaldo was somehow able to take the lead against PSG. Oh, what a pass from Anthony. I know what I'm finished. There we go. Prime Messi's got nothing on Ronaldo. I shouldn't have said that because that made PSG angry. And you're about to see what happens when PSG gets mad. Oh, Mbappe, stop it. Mbappe, stop it. Mbappe, stop it. Oh, no. Prime Messi's in. Oh, my days. Messi, please, 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 Messi. Why do you have to do this to me? Oh, no. Mbappe, please, 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 Mbappe. Offside. 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 That's not offside. Ronaldo and Man United did their best to try to get back in the game, but unfortunately, it wasn't enough, and Ronaldo watched in horror as Messi lifted the Champions League trophy. Moving into Season 4, it's now World Cup time, and Ronaldo trained super hard to make sure that he'll never lose to Messi ever again. We got prime Ronaldo now, come on. First up in the round of 16 was Spain, and noodle hair Ronaldo would go to work by scoring a hat-trick and sending the Spaniards home with ease. Easy win for Ronaldo, man. Spain's too easy, bro. And it would be a similar story against France in the quarterfinals as Ronaldo would score directly from kickoff. Dude, he can't be stopped. He can't be stopped. Unfortunately, Prime Griezmann would tie the game for France, but then in the 90th minute, Bernardo Silva would step up to save the day. Easy, man. France, give me someone harder than France, man. That was too easy. I thought the semifinals against Brazil would be harder, but Ronaldo made it look easy once again, and we were through to the final, but this time a real challenge approaches as we now face Messi and Argentina. This is going to be Ronaldo's toughest game yet, as he's going to have to get past Prime Emmy Martinez, Prime Angel Di Maria, and of course, Prime Lionel Messi. And if you made it this far in the video, please make sure to subscribe. Thank you. Run Ronaldo. This is it, Ronaldo. Finish that. Please. Yes. Prime Emmy Martinez can't stop a Prime Ronaldo. Come on. Run Ronaldo. That was a beautiful ball. Have a go. Bang. Oh, Prime Ronaldo from 40 yards out. We might have been 2 0 up, but the game wasn't over, and Messi and Argentina really started putting on the pressure. Di Maria, please. No. Oh, what a save! Patricio! Oh my, who is that? Who is that? Who just scored? Los Celso! This guy! Fortunately for us, Argentina would run out of time. Oh, we've won! We've won! That's it! There we go! And just like that, Ronaldo would win the World Cup and achieve his lifelong dream. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to watch this video down below next and make sure to subscribe. Thank you.